slash cubing. And yes, you read the title of the this video. It is true. I burnt my hand. How did it happen? Well, I was just making some patty milks or what they are are like grilled cheese with a, a burger. I was just barbecuing them. And then once I had turned on the gas maybe and tried to light the, the barbecue grill, it just exploded with gas and it just, I'm in pain. I'm s It was painful like at the start. And, and in fact, I'm still in pain right now. If you're watching this video, please subscribe to make sure that this video gets a million views because I just did something stupid. Cupid, you will be laughing at this. <laughs> I'm sorry, everyone. It just... <laughs> like, it just happened, basically. And now I put it, um... um I even put it on numbing medicine basically on my hand it's it has an anesthetic or something and i my mother wrapped it around in a in a gorgeous cake cast with an ice pack right. if you're watching this mom thank you so much masterpiece yes so by the way i, I am fine and i'm doing fine and i will s still be doing one-handed basically because i haven't been doing one-handed with this arm i've been doing it with this arm Basically, I still can do it, basically. I can still do it. <laughs> At least, the moral of this story is basically, don't light eat a barbecue when it's completely filled with gas. <laughs> like, what, like, what happened to me, like, basically. So, but, this is not the only injury I had. Um, I broke my leg, like, a few years, like, when I was in fifth grade. It, it. Like, when I tripped and fell on my broken leg when I was playing football, it hurts. Trust me. It really doesn't. I don't really like it. <laughs> Reflecting back to it now, all my injuries, basically, it just hurts, basically. It just hurts. And it still is hurting. Ow. Oh, it actually hurts. So, some... So, basically, I now have two arms. One of them's really good, and the other's extremely bad right now. But it's still in fine shape. So, and in about, like, a week or two, I'll be able to recover and do some normal solving again. But in the meantime, I'm going to have to put this arm on hold from cubing at all. So, um, I'm going to be mainly practicing one-handed for my next competition, which is Michigan. Which is up in Fort Wayne, actually. And Luke Garrett's going there. And, and if you not just see, basically, a world record has been broken. Tommy Cherry, congratulations with your new clock world record average. It's just insane. Like, like I, I don't feel... I'm not in the mood of getting a world record right now, basically. Because I have this! And it just hurts so bad. It just hurts. I know Z3 cubing that you hurt your hands. You broke it. It just hurts. Now we're in a similar situation like this. So if you like, if you love this video, make sure to leave a like and comment down below. And if you're new to this channel, stay subscribed so you can be notified for any future videos. I hope you guys learned something, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Yo, bro, how is that broke, burnt arm? It's just horrible! Bro, I'm sorry for you. No, man, it's fine. I'm basically used to it. I burnt my hand years ago, basically. Ciao, guys!